Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. My name is Kevin. This is 22 Ways. It's December the 27th. It's about 11.15 and uh, we're just getting started this morning. We're going to try a little midday sneak attack on these squirrels and see if we have any better luck than we have been on our evening hunts. Um, we came yesterday evening from about 2 o'clock till dark. Made five trees. Saw three out of five and was only able to harvest one. These things are denning up uh, really quick right now for some reason. I guess because it's late season. We're just coming out of this deep freeze, too, that most of the country's experienced. So we're supposed to be warming up to around 40 degrees today. So hopefully it'll be a good day, and we'll have a few squirrels to show you on the ground. So uh, y'all stick around, and we'll see what happens. All right, guys, we used in here and found the first squirrel. I believe we got him. All right, Betty, good job. All right, good girl. Bonus. I thought was a den tree turned out to be a squirrel tree we got the squirrel if i can show y'all right there yep so we'll see if we can get this thing down for you all right uh all right just fixing to send the dog have to turn around and spot this thing So that last tree just reaffirmed something for me. Um, I touched on in, uh, if you watch the video where I killed my, my limb, the first limit for this year, actually the only limit for this year, but uh, there was a squirrel, I believe it was in that video, but there was a squirrel, we were treed on a, a small tree that had a hole in it. And um, I pointed out there was a den hole in there, but not to give up too soon because you find them on the outside sometimes. So that was a perfect example back there. Um, we rolled up on that tree and uh, the dog was treed hard. Uh, but it was a huge oak tree, and um, in my mind, we weren't going to find this squirrel already. And then when I found those uh, three three holes in the in the tree, and it being late December, um, I was just going through the motions for the dog. I was just uh, we were just doing some uh, some tree work, I guess you would say, um, encouraging the dog on the tree and just you know covering all the bases for the dog. Um, but in my mind, there was no squirrel there um, until we was. You know, I was making some big circles. That's what I usually do is uh, encourage the dog close and then I'll I'll step back and she's treated again. Uh, but I'll step back and, um, you know, go through the whole motions like I was. And I was just about to send the dog. Um, actually, I'd already commanded her to go and uh, she didn't leave the tree. And I happened to look up and I seen that squirrel sitting up there. So, so uh, don't dismiss your den trees too soon like I did there. I mean, I could have very easily called that dog if I would have been going the opposite direction. 
may not have seen that squirrel the way it was sitting um, because I was just half looking anyway. So we're gonna roll in here. Um, she's at 235 right now. See if she'll stick this tree and maybe we'll have another squirrel. Sometimes it works, sometimes it don't. So here, the dog is not super fired up on this tree. Um, she's been down in here for a couple of minutes, barking around. And that squirrel just jumped out as we was talking. Let's see if she can find it. I didn't see it, I heard it. But what I was going to say while she's looking is uh, this tree she's treed on it had a deer hole in it. And um, I was going to remind us not to give up because they were on the outside a lot of times. So. Now, I will say, in my experience, that when a squirrel bails out like it just did, that it is trying to get to a hole or a nest or a big pine tree, somewhere it knows it can survive. And um, we'll just have to give it, we'll have to spend a little time here and see if we can locate this squirrel. I'm not sure which tree it went up. She seems to like that one right there, so we'll be back if we find him. Well, it didn't take us long. About the time I cut you off, I found it. So let's see if I can shoot it. It's way up there. That should have done it. Okay. So, she had the right tree. Good girl, baby. So this has turned out to be a pretty interesting, interesting hunt. Um, that's number three. Good job. Had a runner, but he didn't get to run far. This way, girl. So 
I can find this thing, I'll cut it back on, see if we can put the shot on camera for you. Okay, we've located him, I think, see if we can do this. Good girl, I was watching this squirrel as I was walking in. He was going as high as he could get. I think I still see him. Yeah, he just got on the back side. See if we can ease around here and get an angle on this guy. It'll be a long jump to the sides of the bell. Good job, Betty. Good girl. There's actually three different squirrels in here. Um, and she trained this one. I've seen two other squirrels um, climb different trees. So. Let's see if we can get this one. I think we got him. Crappie flopping. Good job, girl. Good girl. Nice job. Yeah, come on. We don't want no part of that thing. That thing stank, don't it? Whew. No good. the little rascal. Let's see if we can find a little window to get him. Good job, Betty. Good job, Betty. Nice job. Betty. So we have located the eighth squirrel of the day if we can get him shot. So let's see what happens here. I believe we did it. Good job, Betty. Good job, Betty. Tangled up. A jungle here. All right. Man, let's see him, dude. Good job, girl. All right, guys, y'all join me in giving Black Betty here a big round of applause, man. She just done a fantastic job today. One of those days I wish you could have just been in the woods with us so you could have watched her work. Uh, but she done everything as good as I think she can do it. Um, she never left the tree. Uh, she stuck some pretty deep trees. But, uh, man, she just done great. We got started late. 
got started about 11.15. We put the eighth squirrel on the ground at 2.39. And uh, we're going home early. So, I mean, you can't ask for nothing better. I hope it was entertaining for you guys. Thank you guys for watching. I uh, hope you tune back in for the next one. And we'll see, uh, see you in a day or two. Bye-bye. Oh, 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 oh,